Hello, long time no see. Today, I'm thinking about being back to Japanese. So last time I stopped at lesson nine, and so I have another lesson thirteen. But lesson ten, eleven, and and twelve, I haven't finished. So today, I think like I will be back with a different kind of presentation. I'm not sure if it work. But then let's try. I don't do lesson 10 all in this video because this one is just a trial. So just see how we go and to see whether you like this format, then we will be continue to do so. Is it okay? Yeah. Now. I do this one in Zoom, so, okay, I made this, but just, uh, this one is just vocabulary, so only six slices of five, so let's start, this one is lesson, oh no, where's lesson, why start with this one? Let me do it again. Sorry. <sighs> I plan to do this one in one shot. I'm not going to redo the video again because I don't have much time. So this one is Mina no Nihongo. Lesson 10, vocabulary. Uh, if I do vocabulary only it will be faster but then this one I will put examples as well I plan to divide into vocabulary and then but not sure just take this trial uh, so this one is vocabulary and the first this one is a verb imas it's to exist to be so it's referred to animate animate things such as people or animals so let's take an example asoko ni sato san ga imas let's see if i can no Let's see. Mm. That's back then. Oh no. It was wrong. Okay. Then it's funny. Let's see if it, I can do something. This one is a door. Oh yeah, I can make it. Sa do. Oh no. Yeah, sa do. Asoko ni sato san ga imas. So asoko is over there. Ni is like a preposition. Asoko ni. Sato san is mits sato ga is another preposition ga imas and that's the verb. Let's see if I can erase this. Yay, I can erase sato. Okay, let's move on to the next. So imas is used for human. Or animal. Okay, the next one using for inanimate thing. Arimas. Also to exist to be, but 
is used for things that can't can't move, such as tsukue ni oh no no tsukue no ue ni shashin ga arimasu. So let's see this one. This one is tsukue, which means the desk, and this one is u e. Yeah, is on. Like on the surface, u e ni. Shashin means photos. Sha shin. Uh, yeah. Ga arimas. Just after the nail, you say ga before arimas, before imas. Ga imas. Ga arimas. Just put the nail and then ga arimas. I would talk about this in the grammar section how i can do it well okay it will be this one is just my trial so it will take a bit of your time so bear with me okay then next um iro iro na means various this one is an adjective a na adjective. So when it combined with a nail, it will have na. Example. Rezoko ni iroiro na mono ga arimasu. Rezoko, which means refrigerator or fridge. Let's see. Re oh, this one is very long. Rezoko. I'm so lazy, sorry. E. Rezoko. You can look it out in the dictionary. <laughs> Rezoko ni iroiro na mono. Mono is easy. I will write mono then. Oh dear. Oh, that's hard to use. It's mono ga arimasu. Iroiro is like various and mono is thing. Rezoko ni, like in the fridge. Iroiro various. Mono thing ga arimasu. Have or there are. Then next one. Yeah, this one. Men, women, boy and girl. Otoko no, otoko no histo. Anna no, anna no histo. Otoko no ko. And anna no ko. Okay. I think that's all for today. This one is just a trial. Because I haven't done this for such a long time. And... I want to kick start it. So if you like it, I'm not sure. If you like it or you don't like it, I will continue to do this one anyway. Okay. Thank you. This one is just a part one. I will try my best to continue it. Okay. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.